Tennessee. I'm in Idaho. And I'm trying to uh, I'm trying to run down this mountain. Uh, straight up mountain driving, man. This 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 is a uh, I think a seven percent hill. Part six. Six or seven. Uh, um, it's for uh, I think around five or six miles. It is not something you want to play with at all. Uh,
Now, even though I downshifted, I'm still at 25. He's got to watch it coming down these mountains, man. I got my hazards on just in case there's some super trucker behind me. It's going to be like, all right, I can do this at 100 miles an hour. Let him go past if that's what he wants to do. If that's what he wants to do. All right, this is too slow. I'm going to kick her up a little bit. I just, I just shifted up on him. You know what I'm saying? Shift it up. Now she's now she creeping up past 1100 RPMs. And um, she creeping up about 25 mile an hour. Um, let's go ride that out. 1300 RPMs. 27 miles an hour. Now the scenery, yeah, scenery is beautiful. You know, beautiful place. And it, it, this is one thing I've learned about, I say the world, the prettier the place, the more dangerous. I don't know why that is. Well, I found me a good sweet spot. I'm at 30 mile an hour, doing about 1300 and a half RPMs. You know, y'all comment in the bottom, should I shift up and go faster? Should I just lead a sweet spot where it's at and just and revel in the bad meat? Should I just revel in the bad meat? Or I just run down the hill? You know? You know, is there a, will y'all come in the bottom tell me should I shift up? Or how fast y'all think I should have went down to 7% green? With winding turns. Right now I'm doing about 30, 31, 14 on them. RPM. Should I just go up one gear and get her up to 35, 40? If that way y'all think I should be comment in the bottom now. Come on, come tell me. Like, listen, you could have went faster. I would have went this speed. I would have went that speed. But what I'm trying to do is make sure you don't die. You can die out here. This is not a joke. Messing with these mountains. And you can get complacent on one of these mountains, mess your brakes up, and die. You understand? And die. That is not a joke. So I just want y'all to be, uh, I want y'all to be prepared, man. I want you to be prepared. I want you to, you know, to know what where the dangers are to get back to your family and don't play with this trucking thing because you can crash this truck not die truck catch you on fire and you burn to death alive it has happened beautiful though oh my god beautiful that's a picture right there I should have been oh my god that's a picture that is a beautiful picture right there I wish I could have gotten there but what are you gonna do I'm about to do a circle curve up here you understand and uh that's, that's going to be that. I just wanted to come through and tell y'all, you know, be safe on these mountains. These mountains are not a joke. Don't play around with them. Don't, 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 don't mess around with them, man. Be safe. That's what it's all about. Up, up. Okay, I'm still, I'm still at about, uh, I'm still, I'm still at about 13, huh? 30 mile an hour. It tells me to go 20 mile per hour around this curve. Okay? If you know anything about trucking or if you was in a trucking school, you would know we're supposed to go less than what that sign says. That speed indicator is made downshifting. That speed indicator is made for four-wheelers. They ain't got nothing to do with trucks. You're going to go 5 to 10 miles an hour under that, that, that uh, marker. That's what I would tell any of my students that they was running with me or anything like that. Looks like I'm coming out of the uh, mountain now. If y'all like these type of videos, y'all let me know if you like these type of videos. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, at Trucker Brown. And if you sub to this channel, this channel has value as far as your trucking career and life, period. Thank you. Hit the bell. We Audi 5000.